Hi, this is Julian from AWS. In this video, I'd like to show you how you can easily deploy machine learning solutions using Amazon SageMaker Jumpstart, a new capability that we just launched. Jumpstart is integrated with SageMaker Studio, so that's where you should go first. Open the SageMaker Studio console, and you will see this explore one-click solutions box okay so let's try and do this let's go to SageMaker jumpstart and we can see a list of solutions maybe we want to view all of those okay so fraud detection credit decisions predictive maintenance detecting malicious users reinforcement learning demand forecasting uh, quite a few things here um, yeah, let's go all the way. Document understanding, product defect detection. Oh, that sounds cool. Okay, let's do this one. So what is this about? Uh, let's see. We have some background information and we can see what this is about. So it's about visual inspection, uh, figuring out automatically if there's a defect, a manufacturing defect in a picture, okay? So we see some examples. And this is based on, of course, a reference data set. We can see the architecture that's used here. And of course, some extra links. Okay, so, well, let's say this is a business problem that I uh, care about, and, uh, and I like to see how I can solve it using a machine learning model okay what do you have to do click on the launch button so let's do that done okay so this will uh, run for a little while as uh, SageMaker deploys the necessary aws resources actually this is based on uh, aws cloud formation or infrastructure as code service and if you go to the cloud formation console you'll see uh, uh, a stack being created with all the appropriate resources. Okay, but we really don't need to know this. We can uh, very happily ignore that fact and stay in SageMaker Studio and wait for this solution to be deployed. Okay, so I'll pause the video now and I'll be back when the solution is ready. The solution has been deployed and uh, I see I can open a notebook for it. Okay, so clicking on this opens a first notebook and I'm seeing a first notebook because this solution actually has four notebooks. Okay, the first one deploys and predicts with a pre-trained model. The second notebook shows you how to do fine tuning on the, on the model. Um, the third notebook shows you how to train the uh, detector from scratch, okay, instead of fine tuning. And the last notebook shows you how to train a classifier from scratch. Okay, so I'm guessing, you know, is there a defect or not in the image? Uh, so you can see there's a, you know, this is really an elaborate example. And, uh, and I suggest running the demo, uh, understanding uh, how this all works. And then obviously then trying it with uh, your own images and your own data set. Um, but there's already a lot of existing code to start from. And that's the whole point of ML solutions. Um, you have uh, an AWS architecture based on different services. And of course, each solution will use a different set of services. And you also have uh, quite a few notebooks to understand the problem better and then customize it for your own data. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Uh, have fun experimenting, and uh, when you're done, okay, don't forget to delete the solution, right? So let me do this now, delete, and this will delete all the AWS resources that were automatically created when we launched the solution. Okay, don't forget to do that, otherwise you're going to be charged. Okay, well, that's what I wanted to show you on ML solutions. Um, End-to-end -end architectures and examples to solve typical machine learning problems. So have fun, experiment, ha happy to answer any question that you may have. And uh, if you have any feedback, please feel free to get in touch. Okay, I'll see you soon with more videos. Bye-bye.